just sounds so nice and mellow. It makes me like dreamy, sleepy instantly. I love this toy. If you want to know more about this Rhodes piano, check out yesterday's video. Today, I, I don't have the time to play around with it 24 seven. I was thinking about like taking it apart and cleaning every little bit and repairing the one or two keys that aren't hitting like exactly. But I don't have the time for that. I just got an email with like really great big news. I'm coming to you with great news. That's the email I got. That usually never happens to me. An email that starts with, hey, I got great news for you. Beatport request um, for a playlist in Best New Dance Electropop, a store feature for Dance Electropop with a banner and inclusion in weekend picks. That's amazing. This never happened to me ever before. This was always a dream of mine being like on the front page, at least of dance electropop and have like a banner. That usually means a lot more place, a lot more attention. Maybe even, maybe, maybe getting into the charts. I don't know, maybe with your help it's possible. I don't know, but yeah, great news. The only drawback, and it's just a small one, we need to reschedule the release two weeks up front ahead, like, this Friday, the song's coming out this Friday. I was expecting in three weeks, but it's this Friday. Happy to share it with you a little earlier, but also there's a ton of stuff I need to take care of. A lot of emails, a lot of phone calls, a lot of business stuff. So um, yeah, let's get that out of the way. Ooh, by the way, I know you expected this. <laughs> We're kind of done um, doing videos like, hey, my name is John Sign, my new release is out then and blah, 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 like this kind of promotional stuff for Instagram, Facebook, all social media, also for the label, found frequencies, also maybe lost frequencies will post it on his channel and then also getting in contact with all of my DJ friends, sending them the promo so they can play it, play it uh, in sets, play it in live streams, play it in front of people hopefully one day when COVID is over. And there's much more I need to take care of, but first, a little break lunch. It's not going to be pretty. Yeah, this is pretty bad, but I forgot to buy stuff and I don't have the time to drive somewhere and really get something proper, but it's fine. I mean, chili sauce makes everything delicious again. By the way, I don't know if you can hear it, Like down below, the B studio is rented out to two guys that are actually signed to Armada. They're like using the studio to work there, make some new music. I talk to them, listen to their music. It's really dope, cool stuff. By the way, the last shot, me sitting at the table eating, that's not reality. Like my laptop is here, I'm working while eating, drinking on the phone, eating. Eating this will take me like half an hour because I'm like in between doing other stuff. At least it's not like, getting worse by getting cold, it's already pretty, pretty bad. Wasn't such a pleasing fun day, like just doing a bunch of stuff really fast. I got now maybe one more hour to just play the roads a little, play the guitar a little, and actually I don't have that hour. Vanessa's already waiting at home, but I'll, I'll take that hour somehow and I really need again people here in the studio to help me like we had interns always all the time during COVID not really anymore I just have Andy helping me we actually need two more people here in the studio so if you're interested you want to work here make some money or maybe just like an intern during school learn something have an insight into music production how a studio is being run how this YouTube channel works all this kind of stuff then please apply first link in the description if you're interested that you're very welcome just um make sure you live close by you need actually to come here germany dusseldorf small little city it's actually not that small but yeah if you're close by let us know and next up yeah playing the roads and then heading back home in style shining, shining. i'm not up for the feet I 
it's so unnecessary. But unfortunately, I don't have a car at the moment. The car you usually see is Vanessa's. She has a new job. She needs the car to get there, so I don't have one. Taking an Uber is quite expensive. I think it's about time to buy me a car but I spent so much on gear. It needs to be something really cheap, inexpensive. So if you have any suggestions, let me know. Open for everything that just gets me from A to B. I just, I just ordered a car online. Same day delivery, it arrived. It's within my price range. It's really nice. There's just like one, one little problem. It's an R8. Warning, choking hazard, small parts, not for children under three. I'm older than three, I can guarantee you that. This one is an R8 for two people and electric, fully electric. I just have to assemble it tomorrow, tune in. You'll see me right to the studio with this one right here.